How's it going, guys? It's and Luigi, and welcome back to more Let's Play Mario Kart 7. Last time, we did the Leaf Cup. Now, we're going to be doing Lightning Cup, and that is the final cup, so this is actually the finale, folks. Um, yeah, the cart combo that was suggested to me has already been chosen and is already here, because, you know, my 3DS is an absolute piece of shit, and I'm going to say this again. I'll scream it to the heavens until I die, never buying another physical copy of a 3DS game ever again for the rest of my life. And I just want to say this now, though. <laughs> the cart combo was suggested by Epic Joe 17 Rosalina, the Cloud9 cart, the Roller Wheels, and the Flower Glider. Let's go. <laughs> Lightning Cup has some pretty decent courses, so I'm kind of looking forward to this. Well, since my 3DS has been fucking up so much, I've only been able to experience Koopa Cape and Dono Dono Jungle, basically. The, far the farthest amount of minutes I've made it into a recording is like maybe six and a half. It's just ridiculous, you know? I, I, can't, I know I keep, like, t I, I feel like I talk about this in, like, every fucking video. It's just so irritating. You know, it literally murders my motivation to record. You know, that's why I don't want to buy physical copies any game a anymore of, ga of 3DS games. Because I don't want this happening where I just do not feel motivated at all. Okay, I don't know what happened to my third red shell, because I had three and I only threw two. I guess somebody got hit by it, I don't know. Oh yeah, that's real great, just fly right by Peach. Fly right by Peach. Seems, leaves legit, leaves legit. Alright, let's put this as, up as defense. Makes sense that Koopa, Koopa's catching up, you know? This is, a, this is his course, right? <laughs> uh, oh, fuck, the fucking cheap cheeps, dude, they get in the way really bad. I gotta keep grabbing coins, though, so I can get extra speed. How the hell are they catching up to me? They didn't even grab any. Okay. Okay, Peach is gonna throw that red shell. I really hope Tanuki doesn't. Okay, that was really close. That thing, Tanuki literally disappeared right after the red shell hit me, so that was... Okay, thank the lord, I'm getting really- There's some really close calls right here. Tanuki just disappearing and me just clearing that gap when I got hit by the lightning. Because if you get blue-shelled or lightning over a gap, that can screw you over so bad. That actually happened in my original attempt of this recording. I was in first place and then I got blue-shelled over that mini gap um, when you come out of the water tube. And I fell into the pit and went from first to fourth. And it basically screwed me out of the trophy, and that's why I, Okay, what the hell is going on? Did you see that? Did you see that? R right when I entered the pit, I just practically stopped. Why did that happen? Okay. It, I, you know what? God fucking damn it, Peach. There we go. I need to use my mushroom. She's fucking right on my ass. God, I hate how you can't snake in this game, man. I really wish they went to back to the double dash engine where snaking was broken. And the gameplay was based more on skill than pure luck at the end with fucking blue shells and shit. And make it so much better. Okay, I'm gonna put up this Tanuki just to be on the safe side. Um, okay, I didn't even... I, that's what I don't like. I don't like how when you put up Tanuki, it still counts as you holding or, or having, having, having not used an item yet. So if you grab an item box, it's like useless. That's what I don't like. Okay, surprisingly... No... I was just about to say, surprisingly no blue shells, and then I look down and see fucking Lakitu has one in his inventory. That's perfect. Yeah, Peach is gonna catch up. Oh, yeah, red shell. Okay, at least it didn't count. At least I was still in hurt mode, and it didn't do anything. Thank the lord. Okay, and that cheap cheap didn't really affect- Oh, come on. Why didn't the trick work? Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, yes, they gave me a mush. Boom! Oh god, Peach is catching up. Holy shit. How did she catch up? Like, she must have got a mush too and I wasn't paying attention. Or she got a blue boost, because I used that mush and she was still right on me. Oh my lord, that was close. Wow, that actually took, like, a few minutes to complete. Ugh, that re that blue shell, man. I swear, I don't, I don't even think it's possible to go a race without a blue shell. It's so rare. And you know what? <laughs> you know what's crazy? If you guys haven't heard, they're actually putting the blue shell in Smash Bros. as an item. Nintendo knows how trolly it is. They put it in Smash. They know. They know. They know it's that infamous. You know, it's funny. Come on, shy guy. Would you? Uh. Okay, both of them have fucking. Okay, I, I. I was afraid to run into Koopa because I feel like, even though he has a bomb in his back, it can still affect you, and that that worried me. Worried me. I like how they brought that brought this back from Double Dash. You know, it wasn't one of my more favorite courses. 
But I, st I still liked it, you know? So Double Dash courses were some of the best. You know, R R Double Dash Rainbow Road was easily my favorite Rainbow Road. Okay, thank God. Rosalina was slowing down again. Motherfucker, and I'm in third. At least I, I can't believe- I'm like accidentally hitting people with my defense. It's fucking awesome. Oh, jeez, that green shell's still active. Fuck. I knew it. I knew it. I knew that was gonna happen. S I, I knew it. There was nothing I could do. Okay, can I get a trick off of this? There we go. Okay, yeah, Peach, Peach and Cooper are my right. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, yes, I dodged the blue cell. Let's go. Oh, thank God, I didn't get hit by the, the after blast either. Oh, my gosh. Close calls of the ass. Oh, did you notice that? They changed the music when you go into the boardwalk. That's actually a pretty cool touch. And then when you go back here, it's like more upbeat. Oh, wait, no. Again, with me killing them with defense. Oh, my Lord. This is insane. Okay, I gotta hold the A button down more. I still feel like I'm slowing down. You know, they should not be catching up this quick. Fuck, he has a red shell. Are you kidding? How did it- What? I was in midair. Since I did not- What? I did not know red shells can hit you in midair. That's- That's pretty insane. Alright. Oh, looks like we got a double decker blue shell in this race. At least Koopa's fucked over. Okay, Shy Guy, I don't think we have to worry about too much. I, I'm pretty sure Peach and to or Peach and Koopa are still the main rivals, so... Oh, fuck, 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 fuck! Ha! Huh. I, I don't think I had a choice right there. I think I was in that situation where it was either get hit by the green shell or get hit by the banana. There was not enough space. Too much stuff, not enough space! Okay, let me... Ah. Missed the item box. Fuck. Item box, what the hell is wrong with me? Did Shy Guy take the shortcut, or is he just slowing down? Oh, yes, Koopa just got hit by his own shell. Not even bad. Ooh, that was close. Jumped onto the dino. Okay, last lap. Here we go. I'd be amazed if another blue shell just came out of nowhere. It'd be a triple, a triple threat blue shell. That'd be, that'd be pretty insane. All right, we're going to be moving on to the, uh, the, what, the airship course next? I don't really like this course that much, <laughs> to be, to be frank. This, this course is not very fun. There's a, there's a lot of hazards. There's one section, though, where drifting is very useful, and if you don't know how to drift by any chance, then eek, you're probably going to have trouble winning this, especially in 150cc, but yeah, there's a lot, there's a lot of hazards in this course. There's, like, moles that come out of the ground. There's fire. There's bullet bills right here in the beginning. It's pretty annoying. Okay, let me see if I can do this, though. Oh, shit. Sometimes you can maneuver a trick off of these little gaps right here. Oh, there we go. See, I actually got it. It's tough, though. It's tough. Uh, Koopa's got a red shell. Fuck. That, that, that's, that's, that annoys me. How he gets a red shell in first, and I get a green shell in second. Mario Kart, why you make no sense? Oh, that, that, this little section right here is actually good for, um, drifting as well, but that wasn't the section I was talking about. Yeah, you're gonna want to weave on that area right there. And don't go onto the, uh, mesh gate part, because, um... What's it called? That, that slows you down. And this this is the part I was talking about with the, with the constant drifting. Definitely helps with speed. And then you can get a little bit of an extra drift right off of there to the left. Re really, really useful. Okay, let me put it right over the finish line. There we go. Put it back up defense right again. Okay, it looks like Peach got a blue boost or something because I heard her go Yahoo and then she was right behind me. <laughs> I'm not looking at the bottom screen too much, so I don't even know really if she's getting mushrooms or not. Oh, was that a... Did a red shell just come behind me? I didn't even notice. Good thing I put up defense. Oh, we got a mush! Yes, not even bad. Uh, I'm always I'm always gonna get scared on these sections because you can get lightning on lightning on those, then fall to your death, and then die. Wow, we actually have a pretty impressive lead right here. Not even gonna lie. Oh, whoever put that banana there? That's pretty smart. Oh, maybe it's because we have the 10 coins. No, no, no. Look at that. Do you, look at look at 5th place through 8th place right now, right now. Look at all the mushrooms. Do you see that shit? <laughs> oh, oh. Gotta put up Tanuki. Did not see that red shell coming right there. Alright, we're just about done. We have a really, really good lead. I was saying how this course was, like, fucking difficult. We're actually raping right now, honestly. Well, actually, no. Koop, Koopa's, Koopa's starting to catch up a little bit, but we're, we still have a pretty impressive lead. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, that, see, look at that. Just that one bump was able to get Koopa. Yep, uh, no, we're, we might come in second right here. 
Metal Mario's got a blue, and we're just about to cross the finish line. I hate that so much, dude. No, let me cross the finish line! Let me cross the... Yes! Yes! <laughs> oh, that was beautiful! I crossed the finish... Yes! Oh, my God. Yay! And we're beating Koopa by eight. Not even bad. Oh, my God. Yes, that was beautiful. I cannot believe it. Oh, but we have to do this now. SNES Rainbow Road. Probably one of the hardest courses in this game in general. And probably one of the hardest courses in Mario Kart in general, to be honest, you know. Besides maybe Toad's Turnpike or something like that. This is really tough because there's swamps. It's a narrow path. People are constantly bumping into each other. And you can fall off the edge. Anywhere. So, th this is one of the worst courses to play online. And I hate, hate when people pick it. It makes me want to DC, honestly. Okay, yeah, you're, you're gonna... That, those times right there, sometimes the thwomp can completely block your path and it's really tough to get behind them. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez, he's gonna land on me. That was fucking close as hell. What just happened? How did I get a trick? Alright, then. Bow, 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 now. It's good, though, that the thwomps can make shockwaves to you. Whoa! Did you see that bomb bomb just get launched? Oh, my lord. I thought that was actually gonna land right in front of me. That would've been pretty... Insane accuracy Hail Mary shot. Oh my god. What are the what is with the thwomps landing like right in front of me, dude? Jeez. Another impressive lead, my god. We don't even have ten coins yet. Are people just like falling off the edge? I'm assuming so, because this is pretty insane. Bow, 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 bow. This is one of my least favorite Rainbow Roads too, I'm not even gonna lie. I don't really like the music. It's really, really short. Even though they made the Mario Kart 8. Oh. That blooper, that blooper right there. Oh, that's awesome. Do you see that? The audio is glitched because a blue shell went as I was going down. That is awesome. The audio glitched, so now you're gonna keep hearing the bam bam. Oh, never mind. Looks like somebody got another one. Go, 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 go. This is the third lap. Come on, don't lose. Yes! Awesome. But like I was saying, I don't really like this Rainbow Road too much because it's the music and it's really, really short, like I was saying. But I was going to make a comparison to the Mario Kart 8 Rainbow Road being short, but the awesome guitar in the background and the cool visuals of, like, you being on the International Space Station and shit like that makes up for it. But yeah, we are done. I'm so, so happy this is a successful recording. Thank you guys so much for watching, though. Please be sure to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed. Subscribe to be updated on future uploads. Don't leave the cart combos, though, because we're done. But yeah. Uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough. The Mario 3D Land finale will go up tomorrow, and then the co-op of New Super Mario Bros. 2 with Sensational GP starts uh, Tuesday, alright? So I will see you guys later. Peace out, take care.